Hello and welcome to PlayStation Racer. My name is Mitchell Morgan and today we have another menu book for you, number 41, which is the Vision Gran Turismo Trophy. And I'm thoroughly looking forward to this one because we're going to be running my favourite car, the BMW VGT. And better still, it will be in our own brand new livery. So I've been really, really looking forward to this one and I'm hoping for some close racing. So for this particular menu book challenge, we've got three races that we're going to need to undertake. The first one will be in America, which is going to be the, the, the um, Autodrome de Interlagos, which is a track that we know. Then we're heading off to Europe for the Deep Forest Raceway in Switzerland. And finally, we'll be heading over to Asia to Japan for the Kyoto Driving Park Challenge. So in this video, we're going to be going to Interlagos. It's going to be the Vision GT champion, uh, trophy. And we need to pick a car because we uh, we could run with a McLaren, but it's it's very, very quick. And anyway, I want to run with my BMW. This is the car that I want to get out there with. Um, we do qualify. We've got the racing medium tires on. Uh, the PP is 850 or less. So what we might be able to do is just take some of these parameters up. I've got these set for a 700 PP race. So that enables us to bring it up slightly. We're still a bit underpowered compared to some of the other VGT cars that are around. Um, but you know, this is a car that I want to run. And sometimes you want to run the car that you want to run. Now, the other thing I should mention is uh, we are going to be running the race in which I'm going to narrate it. And then we are, will also be releasing a video later this evening, which will just be the replay, which is what some of you have been looking for. So at the minute, I'm just checking to make sure that we've got all of the um, tuning components that we want uh, on the car. I think uh, we're all done because obviously we have got the ability to take the performance points up significantly, but I think we'll leave it there for now. We'll head across to the world circuits and just see how we get on. Either it's going to be underpowered and we're going to struggle, or we're going to be okay. So it looks like uh, we got uh, Porsche VGT, Jaguar, Peugeot. So we've got some pretty fast VGT cars in here. Um, seven laps to do this. I could have made a mistake with this car. I really want to run with this car, but there are some really quick cars in there. OK, here we go. Let's see. We're committed. We're starting in 16th place. We're into Lagos. We have got seven laps to chase down these cars. We're going to have to watch the timings to make sure that we are going to be catching the cars in the front. But for the moment, I'm really just going to go for it. Watching turning points, breaking points, getting the power down as quickly as we can is going to be all important here. So just uh, braking as heavily as there as we can to lose the speed with both before we go through the corner. Very often I end up out on that green patch. Fourth gear through here, building the speed up into fifth. Now I tend to brake a little bit earlier into this corner. Some people would dive and brake at more at the second part of that corner. I tend to find it better for me to brake before the corner, lose some of the speed and then build the speed through the corner. Slight nudge on the Mini on the way through there. Don't really want to be banging doors and bumpers with these cars too much. I'm going to try and keep this clean, but minded that we have got to get through the traffic. Uh, just take the outside on that one. Come, oh, we're going to be on the grass. Yeah, but it slowed down, turned in third gear, second gear, just to stop it from going on the grass. Just about managed. There's a bit of a runoff there that you can use, but I'll try not to use that because very often when you get on that, you're heading towards the grass up the hill. Just hug the inside here as we go through that green line following it. 
fifth gear picked up slipstream on these two cars we're going to need to get this slowed down now into the corner third gear second just to get it turned in down the hill up to third apex that one apex this one getting up into fourth as quick as we can that puts us up into 10th position but we still are what 23 seconds away from the car in front big squirm under brakes there just as we'll be getting that slowed down and using the gears it's up into fourth now climbing through the gears fifth again we're going to break just before the 100 meter boards just to lose some of the speed as we go into this corner catching up with this bmw in front of us similar to the car to the one that we're driving that was a nice move done looks like we've got a, a vw in front and then a honda sports car and he's got the inside of the, the vw outside of the honda get it slowed down second gear to get this turned in over the curb up into third gear as soon as we can up into fourth gear slight short shift on that one down it the third for this one and we go up the hill just trying to get on the back of this red car in front of us just go around the outside outside of that AMG which looks super quick so we're actually got ourselves up into where are we fifth place just watch for the braking zone get it slowed down and turned in so we're up into fifth at the moment we're still we're still 17 seconds off of the leader and we are on lap three to get down the inside of this one under braking get it slowed down just about managed to hold that before we went too wide that was really sweet i enjoyed that one let's just keep this together braking on the just after the 100 meter board down into third midway through the corner getting it turned in leaving in third for this one down to second to get the apex feeling it again this particular track with this car is slightly different to what we've been running so I haven't quite got the turning points and the gears down at the moment so sometimes I think about this one's third gear corner I get there and just need to drop down into second for the moment to turn it in oh took a lot of curb there that's pushed us out wide on the exit that was a little bit untidy minded though that we are coming up to the end of lap three to start lap four because four, four comes after three yeah go on um so we're starting i'm oh, crikey starting fourth lap and let me just get around this corner down the hill third over that curve over this one so we are in fourth place and looks like 12 seconds 13 seconds off of the leader five seconds off the car in front oops nearly missed my braking point looking at the time there just get it oh, i've gone wide yeah that was i left my braking a little bit too late into that corner lack of concentration and just went a little bit wide so braking before the corner a little bit later this time near the 50 meter board just trying to carry a little bit more speed through this little section down into second up into the third down into second gets it slowed down and gets the turn in third gives me the traction through the corner um, tends to be the way that I like to drive in particular with this car the third down into second over the apex and we'll come up into third as soon as we can into fourth watching for this final corner don't go too deep this time Mitchell that's better that's nice when we get on the back of this car in front try and get a slipstream up the hill unfortunately he's pulling away from us that shows the speed differential I wasn't too bad on that last corner before the long run up the hill so it does look like these faster cars the three in front of me have got a little bit more performance or oh, just getting it onto the grass that put me round that was a wheel on the grass that's never a good idea 
at least it wasn't a full spin we managed to hold that uh, but don't put a wheel on the grass as you're coming into the first corner because it's always going to bite you that's put me on the back foot we are now nearly 13 seconds behind the leader we're nearly three seconds behind the car in front you need to close up in this little section pushing hard using all of the track come on we're gonna have to break late and fold into this one 50 meter board getting it buried again turning come on Go second over this one to get up behind the guy in front can we get up the inside no can we get up the inside of this one no it's going away from us oh that air brake is really working that gives him a lot of braking power much more braking power than we have he can brake later but we need to be able to get through the traffic that jagger is awesome that's just um gone on my wish list <laughs> right concentrate on driving up the hill just building up through the gears looking at the radar he's not there which is good so let's put us into third gear which is enough for the menu book but it would be nice to try and get oh no wow where did he come from oh, i'm on the grass again and going around on a proper spin this time oh that's stupid a rookie mistake two laps in a row ah i think i was a bit surprised at how that jaguar came back at me i thought we were done he is mighty under braking oh um yeah let's let's just knuckle down i don't really push this now maybe this is the wrong car maybe i need to do pony up some credits and look at getting that um that jaguar that is a nice looking car and the way that, that thing stops that air brake is awesome come on so i've gone a bit quiet here i I really want to get third in this race. Come on. Can we do him up the hill? We've got a slipstream. Come on, pull me up the hill. He's going away from me again. Come on, give me a slipstream. Just trying to just follow him up this hill. I think we did get a bit of a slipstream. Lost it now, though. He's, he's mighty under braking. This is, I've got to close up under braking through this tw more twisty section. Oh, oh, just that was not a move. That was all wheels off the track. That was illegal. That was naughty, but he's got such a far more superior car than me. We've got to try every trick in the book to get ahead and stay ahead of this guy. We've got ahead. The question now is, can we stay ahead of this fast charging Jaguar? Just concentrating through here, down into second, up into third, get it turned over that curb. Just trying to carry more speed through these corners. Second to get this turned in, right on running off ground on the apex on that one, up into third. Sorry if I'm mixing up my words, this is concentration first commentary second my heart is pounding right now oh a little bit of a slide there sorry guys i'm really going for this we need to be ahead of this car climbing up this hill and it looks like we are four seconds ahead of the jaguar behind without those spins we might even have managed to get the second place or is that a back marker i'm not sure oh wow that my friends was hard to get third place that was difficult what a race 
thoroughly enjoyed that. That Jaguar VGT was stunning on the brakes. Took everything at the end of that race to keep that bronze position. Probably going to have to come back and redo this race at some point to get gold. But we'll need to do it in a quicker car. Really pleased to get third. Really pleased to be out in the BMW VGT. And please, if you want to see this video, the replay in all its glory, please join me a little bit later this evening. That should be going out at five o'clock. We'll be heading off to Deep Forest Raceway in the next one. If you're not a subscriber, please consider hitting the subscribe button. Hit the bell for notifications of that video coming very soon. And if you are back and you're already a subscriber, thank you ever so much for your support. This is a new channel that I am trying to build and I welcome all of the support that everybody is giving me right now. In the meantime, stay well, stay safe, and I'll see you again very soon. Take care. Bye-bye.